so guys we have our video in the timeline select the text tool or press on T then write something like my handler is at the rate himmel 356 select your text go to effect control if your effect control is not available then go to window then enable effect control from here let's go back to effect control expand the text scroll down give it a background let's give it black background some space rounded corner change the style after you are done stretch the text in our timeline now bring your social media logo stretch it select the selection tool select the logo layer go to effect control click on the position then position the logo scale down so this will be our final view now the time for animation let's go around half second click on the position watch to make the first keyframe for our logo let's move to one second make another keyframe by clicking on this dot so this is our second keyframe click on the back arrow to move to first keyframe now move the logo to the starting point so this will be our starting point so this is what we got so far now go to effect then search for crop drag and drop crop effect on the text layer select the logo layer again go to effect control go to the first keyframe of the position by clicking on this arrow second keyframe first keyframe now select the text layer again effect control crop hide the logo we will crop the text from the right side so for that click on this stopwatch for the first keyframe now select the logo layer again go to second keyframe by clicking on this arrow now select the text layer click on this dot to make the second keyframe now move to first keyframe by clicking on this arrow increase the right enable the logo again let's see what we have it's really simple after you are done select both text and logo layer right click next let's name it handler move the playhead before your logo start moving so it's started moving from here so we need to go around here now select the layer again then click on the opacity to make the first keyframe now go around like eight frame one two three four five six seven eight now click on this dot for second keyframe now click on the back arrow to go to first keyframe reduce the opacity to zero let's see what we have it's really simple now i think you guys can easily do the animation from right to left so that's all thank you guys for watching have a good day